I'm Stacy, and the plan of the week is the Van Wilgens grown limelight hydrangea tree. And I've got a special guest with me here, but I seem to have lost him. Luke, where are you? Right here. Oh, Luke, come on up. You got to talk with me up here. Hi, Stacy. Oh, hi. You know what? On second thought, I almost think I might have picked the wrong guest because now that you are standing next to the limelight hydrangea tree, I kind of feel like you're taking the limelight away from it with your good looks and your height. I don't know if I made the right choice. You're kind of showing up the plan of the week. These are just baby limelights. Yeah. Once they're in the ground and they get nice and grown up, they're going to be big and bold and strong, just like you. Just like you. You promise? I promise. Oh, all right, Lou. You weren't kidding. This limelight hydrangea tree is stunning in the landscape. Lou, I might even venture to say that it might even be as beautiful as you. I'm sorry. But also I noticed that it's gotten taller than you. What is the width and the height of the limelight hydrangea tree in the landscape? Eventually they'll, they'll get anywhere from about six to eight feet tall. Okay, they can actually get that wide as well. You can oh, actually yeah. kind of see that on this one. Mm -hmm. So I have to say that actually makes this an amazing tree for the landscape. Because when you say there are so few trees that stay this small, about eight feet maximum, height and width, but also get an abundance of bloom. This makes it a really special tree. Also, Luke, I'm looking at it and it is loaded with blooms. There are so many, and they're this gorgeous kind of white citrusy tone right now. Do the colors change as we go through the season? Yep, so just as the name implies, it says limelight, and you get these nice kind of lime green, soft colored um, flowers on here that open up into this more of a sort of creamy white. And then even later on when you get into the fall, they start fading out to a, like a pink color, almost burgundy. Oh, so that's perfect for the fall time. We get this nice kind of pinkish burgundy tones, autumnal colors, which look perfect in the landscape for that time of the year. Also, I noticed that some of these blooms seem to get a little heavy and are pulling some of these branches down. Is it okay to cut off a few and enjoy them in the summer months? Is that all right to do? Yeah, absolutely. Um, you can completely take any blooms you want off and uh, they're really good for cut flowers too when drying. So oh. it's kind of a double whammy thing you get. Yeah. Nice landscape flower and one that you can bring inside and kind of enjoy. Right, so it'll look great in a vase. You can dry them. You can make wreaths out of the dried flowers. Perfect for that. But we can prune a few off selectively. We know that this tree blooms all the way from summer all the way into the fall, which is an awesome another perk about the limelight hydrangea tree. But also, is this the main time to actually like do its real pruning, or when do we prune the limelight hydrangea tree? You really want going to want to prune a limelight or, or any tannical hydrangea, hydrangea like these are. Um, kind of the late fall or early spring because they're going to bloom on the new growth. Oh, okay. Um, and if you really want to try and control the size, you can take about a third of the plant off, uh, but I wouldn't really go any farther than that. All right, so wait, enjoy the flowers this season, get all the way to early spring, and if we want to, we could cut one third of the shrub just to shape it, to give it shape, and it'll still bloom like crazy next season. Exactly. Okay, here's the other thing. Now, I always thought that hydrangeas couldn't handle full, full sun, but here we are. Standing out in the parking lot, it is full bright sun, and this limelight hydrangea is looking awesome. What are the sun requirements for this? They love full sun, um, awesome. as opposed to most hydrangeas. Panical hydrangeas can take the full sun just fine. We've got a bunch right here, and more all over the property um, in full sun locations, but they can take some shade too, which is nice, unlike a lot of the other varieties here. All right, so they'll bloom in full sun, heart shade, Still with this abundant flower growth on it. Oh, yeah. Okay, so I think this is a perfect plan of the week. Limelight hydrangea tree, Van Wilgen's grown. So stunning in the landscape. I think, you know, bringing Luke on, thank you so much. The limelight hydrangea tree kind of met its match with you in beauty and strength and vigor. Thanks a bunch. See you next time.